What is going on guys and welcome back to another video. We are on the dyno. I got Isaiah here in the passenger seat just chilling. Um, so we're on the dyno. I finally decided to take the super on the dyno because on the street as I was turning up the boost and all that um, it was really hard to find traction and it was hot out here and then either it was raining or it's just too hot. So decided to bring it to RevWorks uh, Subaru shop and pretty much decided to throw it on the dyno that way I can actually tune the car it has nice cool airflow hitting it the first I had to turn down the boost for a second but I'm still working in the port injection now this car is stock trans stock motor uh, with a Odyssey fab turbo kit top mount kit for this car uh, with a 62 62 ball bearing that last pull that we just did was 17 psi with some throttle closures up top um, I'm not afraid to hide if there's any throttle closures. I think it was just throttle closing because there was a high correction. This is on full E85. So um, there was a high fuel correction up top as I'm trying to work in the port injection and everything like that. It was 17 PSI and we made about, even with the throttle dropping right at like 50, it looks like 57 um, right here. So this is baseline that I baselined on this dyno, completely stock on 93. So 17 PSI, 17.3, full E85. Um, it made 640 torque and about probably, let me see. So normally this shows a here we go. So almost 600 horsepower, um, just barely touching it. 597, uh, 636 torque. And obviously those are the base numbers. So I'm gonna flash this map and do another pull, see where we're at. I add a little bit more fuel, leave the boost where it's at. Let me just work out the fuel and all that and then I'll start turning it up. Alrighty guys, so so far we are at, let's see, so so far guys, don't mind the little drop off, it's just where the dyno's stopping for some odd reason. Stock number's on the left, right now we're at 18 PSI on peak, rising up to about 21.5 up top. And we're sitting at 663. Um, I just flashed the map. We're gonna see if we can uh, get it a little bit higher and then go from there. see what this thing does on this last pull yeah I'm not gonna beat the hell out of it anymore so. car where it's at at 20 psi just you know maybe like 20 more horsepower maybe if it was a lot 
cooler in the day. It probably would have made over uh, just about 700. Um, I left it where it was at because I was still having cylinder fill desired drops. You know, I'm not afraid to admit it. I still had some drops that I need to figure out. There's a few tables that are going on that I got to work through and, you know, actually go through each and every single one and figure out which table's dropping the load. But other than that, the car pulls the red line. Um, just shy of 700 horsepower probably it was really hot today it's probably about like 90 or 100 degrees in that so the car did pretty well barely hiccuped and stuff like that so i'll keep you guys updated on the next video so if you enjoyed the video please hit the like if you're new to the channel please hit subscribe and peace out guys